Yo guys, it's your boy Holler Logic again with another video. And today I was I was so hyped for the video. I was gonna show you guys my chest opening. I was gonna show you all the replays I did with the deck. Oh, I was so hyped. And then you know what? Try to upload it um, on a private, and then I'll edit it. But um, the file kept crashing. It wouldn't work. So I decided to make a new one. Too bad you guys didn't uh, get to see me um, open my chest. But to be honest, I was hoping for a legendary, but I didn't get any. The good thing is, I didn't have that many tornadoes. Now I do. I also got some princes, dark princes. I don't really use those. So, and I also recorded some battles with my deck. And don't worry, um, I didn't drop down because of my deck. I dropped down because I was experimenting with some decks. This was the deck I used in the ladder after I used it in some tournaments. But I, don't, I didn't have enough time to play. It was, again, in a clash with Ashes tourney. But I was in school. I couldn't do much. Yeah, so I dropped down because I was trying this new deck. I thought it was going to be pretty neat. The main idea of this deck was to split the Musketeers and then split the Elite Barbarians. But it didn't work out that good. I'm not really good with three Muskies. And I'm not going to spoil it for you guys. Uh, I'm going to just start it. I'm going to just start it. Out. Wait, what? This deck... Why is there a fireball? A baby dragon supposed to be there. Okay, now that we got that fixed, I'm not going to spoil it to you guys. If we actually lose or anything, um, I'll tell you guys the feedback on the deck. I'll tell you guys um, some how to counter some decks. Uh, I'll tell you guys how to do proper pushes and make sure your balloon gets to your tower. And yeah. Let's get on with the match. Hopefully we'll win. Because this is one of my favorite decks. Well, I, I've already played it on the ladder. But I'm, for the sake of this video, I'm going to play it again. And I'm going to show you guys how it actually went when I first recorded it. In case it goes the opposite way. Okay, so he has an Ice Wizard in the back. I usually expend Royal Giants when they put an Ice Wizard in the back. So, it's a Giant... We're gonna make it. We're gonna do this. So it'll target the ice wizard. Then we'll do this. Oh, and of course, what? Um, no, no, no. I don't want it. Uh, please don't get a shot. Yes. We defended that tower how I wanted it to. Oh, um, this is a risky move. Oh, no. It's too late, too late, too late, too late, too late. Oh, and it's not too late. Let's go. Oh, and it targeted the princess. Let's go. This is my all-time favorite deck right now, man. I'm really feeling it. Oh, Sparky. Haven't seen those in a while. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if the balloon could target a Sparky? <laughs> I don't know. Is he, is he gonna place on his giant? Yes, he is. Oh, I think that was a tile. Wait. Two, never mind. We're gonna zap. Oh. Oh, I should have placed all my baby dragon. What am I doing? Oh, uh, we're we're good. We're good. We're good. We're doing good. Okay, the wizard ain't gonna be much of a problem. Easy peasy. Okay, we're gonna start off our push again in the back, cause we know he doesn't have his giant in rotation. At least I hope he doesn't, I, I didn't, I don't think he cycled that fast with it. So he doesn't really have anything to target air besides his princess and, um, and wizard. So that's a neat thing. I need to take, oh, and a nice wizard. I forgot about the ice wizard. We're going to take down that prince. At least I thought I was going to take down the princess. But look, the balloon got to the tower. Yes, get another shot off balloon. Oh, but now he has a big counter push, to be honest. Um, we're gonna have to do this. Hopefully, I have six elixir ready. I do. Oh, nope, nope. This is a bad idea. A bad. No, don't target it. Yes, don't target the tombstone. Target, target the most important. Oh, I missed the zap. 
This that was supposed to target those goblins. Oh, we lost that. Oh, we're taking critical. Oh, I never. I, I didn't realize our the left tower had a lot of had less uh less HP. We could easily take it down right now. Zap! Come on, get a shot off. Get a shot off. Yes, one miner. And GG boys. Or a baby dragon shot. Either one would work. <laughs> Yes, we lost the tower, but we got another one. I don't know if I have a crown chest ready. That'll be good. Pretty neat. Yes, I do. So as you guys can see, it works. All right, so far it's working all right in the ladder. Oh, I don't like this starting hand, and he's telling me good luck. I always think negative when people say when people uh, do emotes. I don't know why. And I don't know what to do right now because I have the worst starting hand. I guess you'll do the first move. Oh, please don't. Oh, I missed the hog. Okay. Um, so he's obviously going to have to defend with something with goblins. Um, we're going to have to put some marchers down. Okay, so we have a pretty neat push. Come on, Mega Minion, Mega Minion. Oh, it was so close. We're gonna have to use our miner on that princess because I it's it gets too annoying. Oh, he's actually gonna defend with the lumberjack. Pretty neat. He probably wanted to bait out my Oh no, I have nothing to defend this hog right now. So if he pushes I'm pretty much doomed. I I can't push guys. I can't. If I oh yes, I can now. Oh no, it ain't gonna take it down. Oh, it ain't gonna take it down all the way. So I had to use my zap. I wasted too much elixir though. Come on, baby dragon. No, 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 no. You're supposed to target the princess. Oh, and I think I missed it. Kill it, kill it. Yes, okay. We're just gonna use our tombstone as a defensive one because I only need to save up my mega minion. He's probably gonna zap. No, he's not. Okay, so we're gonna do the push. We're gonna start it off. We're close to double elixir. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Um Yes, he's gonna obviously do that. Oh, I'm gonna have to put down a baby dragon since we're in double elixir. But now I don't really have anything to back up my push. But that's alright. That's all right, guys. It's all right. It's all right. He's gonna push. She's 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 gonna push. Oh, we're dealing a lot of damage. But oh no 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 no. I don't like phasing infernos, even though my deck is pretty good at defending it. Oh, the balloon survived, but it's getting shot down by the other tower. I'm gonna have to zap 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 zap. Yes. Oh, <laughs> no, come on. Lava Pops. Lava Pops for the win. Oh, I'm going too aggressive. Oh, perfect. Perfect goblin placement. Oh, zap, 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 zap. Yes, it took down the princess. Okay, okay, okay. I'm playing pretty poorly right now. But he just uses Inferno, so wouldn't that make for a good counter push? Even if he places his hog, I have enough elixir, I think. Oh, it, oh no, this might cost me the game. Yeah, it cost me the game. <laughs> I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. That, okay, guys, this match didn't count because I was being retarded. I played very poorly nearly the end. I was being too cocky. I deserve that loss. Okay, so I'm going to talk about some tips on how to defend some decks. Uh, that's what people... Uh oh, this is the perfect matchup. People have been telling me, oh, I've been facing a lot of road giants. How do I defend them? Um, so this is a perfect match to show you guys how... Um, I'm going to just back it up because I'm going to have to waste elixir regardless. Um, minion horde. Ooh. Oh, no, no, not good. 
I don't have anything to defend it. I should have saved my. Mm. Okay, so for the Royal Giant, you're gonna have to use your Tombstone with either a Mega Minion or Archers, either one. And the Mega Minion. Oh, I was gonna get some shots off. Oh no, 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 no. He has the Royal Giant like Zap Bait deck of some sort. Oh do do do. So yes. Um, try to place on your tombstone with either. Wow. Why do I always? Mm. I can't do anything right now. What a worst hand. I don't want it to get any shots off on my tower, so I had to use my miner. Hopefully, oh man, I was gonna say hopefully that skeleton survives. See if he places on his road, John. You're gonna have to take out. You're gonna have to take it out, but you're probably gonna have to um take that three no like 400 damage and i don't want to place my lava hound because i know he's gonna place down his royal giant but we have to i'm wasting too much elixir oh he's gonna rock it he has a rocket oh never seen never thought i'd see that coming but look at these look at this push look at this push he has nothing to defend it, at least I believe, besides the minion horde. I forgot about the minion horde. I forgot. Oh, it's so late, though. Huh. And he's, he tried to push lanes because he knew he had it. But look at this. Okay, this is how you defend a proper. Oh, I don't have my mega minion. I was going to say proper, but I need my mega minion. Okay, he's probably going to rock it. All it takes is like two shots. Oh, but it didn't even get two shots. Oh, but that's obviously going to take it down. I'm going to focus because I'm going to focus on the right side now. Um, oh, I should have let it go. Fuck. I don't know what I did right there. Could have backed out my Lava Hound with a better with better support. Oh, no, no, no. I need to maybe drain the Minion Horde. Minion Horde. Minion Horde. Minion Horde. Oof. Oh, my Miner. My Miner went in way too early. Oh no, and the hog. Archers, 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 archers. Please, yes. Come on, we have the win, baby dragon. Oh, we have the win. Oh, zap, zap, zap. I should have zapped. Oh, it's over. See? This deck works great on the ladder. The balloon is still viable. I just lost the last one. I was being way too dumb. You guys saw it all on vid. I was being too dumb. But as you can see, it actually works great in the ladder. Let's just try to let's try to push to 3,800 at least and get back from the losses we had from the elite barbarians. I wanted to use them so bad because they're a new card and I've never really used them. And I was like, I want to use that card. Never seen it. I'm gonna try and make a good deck with it. But as you can see, it didn't work. It didn't work, guys. I think I'm just going. I'm just going to defend, cause I'm. I don't want to get. I don't want to get countered. Pushed way too hard. Oh, oh, he missed the baby dragon though. Damn. Okay, okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll place down my lava. Oh, it's a level eleven too. Hmm. I'm going to just place my Lava Hound on the left side. He wasted too much elixir, but I think he has enough elixir for a counter push of some sort. I don't know if I should place down the balloon, though. Um, We're probably going to have to go with the balloon. He's going to be panicked. Oh, he, but he has minions. He has minions. He has them cheeky little minions. Ooh, but now we start getting the Lava Hound, baby. That's what we wanted. Archers in the back. Oh, nope. This is a bad... Well, we're basically doing tower for tower at, at the moment right now. Because I know for sure this tower is going down. It's going down. No, it's not. At least I don't think it's going down. Well, the miner does a lot of damage. Plus, he has a level 5 golem. What in the... <sighs> Damn, I've never faced a level 5 golem. I don't even know. He's at 3765, a level 11. I don't know if 
it's good on oh he's gonna go for a offensive place down your mega minion oh yes he no please tank for it i'm gonna have to zap oh that was way that was too bad too damn bad oh no we might lose this one I, oh why didn't i back on my lava home with anything this is so bad guys I, we're not gonna have to we're uh we can't come back from this at least i don't think we can oh no no come on come on minor play something down play something down one shot oh Oof. oh no minor I wasted too much elixir. He's gonna win regardless if I get that tower or not. Uh, oh no, we still have. Oh, but he has a lightning. We have one push. We, we, oh, never mind. We don't have a push because he's about to win right here. He's about to win right here. Yep, yeah, he won. Well, good game, I guess. I don't know how a level 11 is at 3700. But alright, I'll take the loss. This deck still works good. I just faced the level 11. Um, I recommend you guys, if you guys want to try it out in the ladder, try it out. It's a very good deck on the ladder too. It just, unless you're like really high up, cause you, or not really high up, you can still use it really high up. The, um, the only thing I'll recommend to you guys is that if you're like around my range in trophies, um... It's going to be a bit risky because you face a lot of level 11s. They have level 12 um, level twelve commons. And yeah, this I recommend you guys use it on the ladder. It works on the ladder. I've been testing it out. And um, since we're getting to the final of this video, when I recorded it the first time, I actually pushed to, uh, to 39.60, I believe with it uh from 38 30 it, it this deck is amazing on the ladder too i just don't like to stick to one deck that's why i love playing a lot of challenges i don't really play on the ladder I play a lot of challenges when ash does tourneys i go to tourneys i don't really like playing on the ladder because you have to stick with one deck and i like trying a variety even though this is one of my favorite decks i've tried the balloon is my all-time favorite I remember back in Royal Arena where the Freeze was still one of the best cards that was used. I used to do Balloon Freeze. Oh, uh, that was a, a good old times. So, some tips. With the Royal Giant, um, uh, try if... They obviously, they're obviously going to support it with either an Ice Wizard or some Minions or Mega Minions. So, what I recommend is... Uh, place down a uh, tombstone and place down some uh, place on a mega minion if they place their own mega minion um, place down archers when the mega minion is sort of in front of it you're gonna have to take some shots off the royal giant so don't worry a lot about the damage as long as you can build a strong counter push um, another deck that I explained in yesterday's video that's um, that gives trouble to this deck are the Hogs. Just make sure you have, when you pledge your Lava Hound, you have a three elixir, at least a three elixir card to counter the Hogs, such as a Mega Minion or Archers or even the Tombstone. Yeah. Um, another thing I've seen a lot is the Inferno. Um, as you guys can see, you guys... Saw how I defeated a guy with an Inferno. You guys can watch the replay and you all tell by yourselves. One more match and then I'll be heading out. Okay. He's a level 10 so we might... So we have a chance on, on winning. Okay, okay, okay. I don't really like this hand that much. Even though the Lava Hound is right here. We're gonna... I don't you really like playing the first card, but I have to, or it's gonna take forever. Um, is he playing anything? Oh yes, he is. I should have pushed the other side. Okay, so now I can't. I don't want to support it with the balloon, cause then it's too vulnerable. I can't support. Oh, what the? 
Oh no, that's bad on my part. Oh, a royal giant with it. Oh baby, we're gonna have to give that tower up. That got me by surprise. GG. Tower for tower. Oh. Uh, my defender's pretty good, I guess. Please don't. Uh, I should have thrown in my miner, but I think that will be an overkill. Well, plus, we're dealing some good damage on the right side. See, guys, that's how you defend a proper roll giant push. Um, so I, I believe he has the elixir disadvantage. At least that's what I believe. He wasted too much elixir. So we could actually push. I'm gonna save my Mega Minion. And he's not gonna he's gonna he's not gonna never mind. I'm not saving my Mega Minion. Cause he's going to put down Oh let's just punish him for doing that. Let's throw in a balloon. Let's throw in that. Oh, I'm gonna give that tower up on the right side, but it was going down regardless. See you guys? Told you. Great deck on the ladder, except when you face level 11s. I, I've been a lot of level 11s with this deck. Thing is, sometimes I can beat them because I either I get the worst hand or there, or they drop for a reason or something. See, it works great on the ladder. I highly recommend it. Um, if you want me, I already told you guys some tips and tricks how to use it properly. So yeah guys comment down um oh we don't need one crown man comment down on the video on what you would like to see next such as clash real content clash of clans um i don't think i'll upload rain glory since it didn't do that good and most people don't enjoy watching it so yeah just comment down what clash real video or clash of clans video you guys would like to see uh comment some decks and i'll try them on I'll try them on try them out um, so yeah, I highly recommend using this deck on the ladder. Uh, just be prepared for level 11s, cause this deck got me to 39.69, I believe. I think that's what I said. And then um, I got bored of playing the same deck all over again, so I went. I uh, played um, this deck and tried it on the ladder. Then I realized it didn't work on the ladder, so I went to a challenge, and that's what got me most of my. Uh, most of my challenges win on uh, the classic challenge. I still haven't redeemed the $100. I have redeemed them, but I haven't spent them on anything. Uh, well, I think I'll probably jam it when the Electro Wizard comes out. Maybe. Shout out to Clash with Ash again. He's one of the best, man. One of the best YouTubers. I. Uh, one of the best YouTubers, yeah. He. Uh,